Well, they say this is where the Giro d'Italia really began. Stage 12 would be a gripping encounter. Cuneo to Pinarolo, evocative of previous great performances, remembering the victory of Fausto Coppi 60 years ago. And not surprisingly, there was quite the scrap for the early break, Thomas de Ghent and Eddie Dunbar pushing. Valerio Conti decided to keep his powder dry. Back in the peloton, the Magliarossa set for a tough battle to retain that jersey. Eventually, it was a group of 24 that made its way clear of the peloton and opened up an advantage on stage, approaching 15 minutes. In the wake, the Team UAE Emirates squad led the peloton, but safe in the knowledge that Jan Palaz was safely in that group up front and heading to glory. Behind, well, the riders from the early breakaway, including Bennett's just, and Haller, showing that they wanted to get going and get to that hill ahead of the stronger climbers. Dunbar and the rest showed that they had the facility on the hills. Thomas Peters going backwards in his white jersey. Miguel Angel Lopez going forwards from the group of favorites. Miguel Landa fancied it too. They look to put some time into Primus Roglic, Vincenzo Nibali and the rest. Up front, the group was whittled down. Across the top of the climb, it was Rambia that took the top points as he led a select group down the descent and towards the finish in Pinarolo. Into the final grippy wall within the final couple of kilometers. Well, came down to a group of five going for glory. Cesare Benedetti getting up ahead of Caruso and Dunbar to take stage honors.